again, YouTube. This is Beanie Bomb, and welcome to Scribble Knots Unlimited. Yay! How was your guys? It's Christmas. Was it good? Did you get everything you wanted? That's awesome. That's good that you got everything you wanted. You didn't get everything you wanted? Well, that kind of sucks, but you should still be grateful because if you have a computer and you're watching this right now, I can tell you that you're a lot more fortunate than other people are. Uh, before we get started, I just want to give a huge thank you to the guy who gave this to me. Uh, I can't remember his username right now, and I'm a scrub, so I didn't bring it up. Um, but the channel, the channel, what? The title will have his name in it, and the uh, description will also have his channel link down below. Yes, there we go, below the video. <laughs> that, that's what I was trying to say. Um, so, yep. Uh, I played a little bit, but I didn't actually play, I just filled it with the options, so I know what the intro is, but I'm not gonna skip it, so, cause you guys don't know what the intro is unless you've already watched this game. Uh, oh yeah, one more thing, um, if you notice the mic quality has changed at all for Christmas, I got a Blue Yeti microphone, which is amazing. Uh, I'm still kinda new to it, so I'll try to avoid as many mic pops and whatnot as possible, but, uh... Let's hope that doesn't happen. I'll get a, a pop filter soon. So, uh, I've, I've wasted enough of your time with this stuff. Uh, let's begin. Our story begins with Grandpa Edgar and Grandma Julie. You might not believe this, but Grandpa Edgar used to be the world's greatest adventurer. Grandma Julie would beg to differ. She was also an adventurer. Edgar would often brush away vines or open doors thought to be undisturbed for generations, only to find Julie was already there, having lunch. They competed like this on adventure after adventure. On one adventure, Julie beat Edgar to the top of a long-lost pyramid. But the treasure she found was an engagement ring. That's a huge the two diamond. Of them semi retired to start a family. And they continued starting that family until they had 42 children. <laughs> Would she be dead by now? Day, Mom and Dad gave Maxwell and me two amazing gifts. The first was a magic globe that let you travel anywhere in the world. The second was the most amazing notebook. This notebook let you write any word in it. And poof! the word would come to life. Our parents were worried about us turning out to be spoiled little brats. So they sent us out to face the challenges of the outside world. On the road to the city, we ran into an old man who said he was hungry. Maxwell made something to give him. But he played a nasty trick. The apple was rotten. Oh, the old man spat it out as soon as he tasted it and was very, very angry. As he cast some sort of magic, he called us spoiled little kids and then disappeared. It didn't seem like anything had happened. But when Maxwell turned to continue down the road, I couldn't follow him. The old man had put a curse on me that was turning me to stone. We didn't know what to do. Luckily, our brother Edwin's farm was nearby. Boy, you should have seen how angry Edwin was. He couldn't believe what we did to the old man and said we probably deserved what we got. Lucky for us, Edwin knew about starites. Starites are magical objects born out of the happiness of others. When you do enough things to make others happy, you will find Starite. Hopefully, if Maxwell used the notebook's power for good, he could collect enough Starite to remove the curse. Maxwell said, That's it! I'm gonna go out and do good things for all the people I can find. I'm gonna get all the Starites in the world, and I'm gonna make you better, Lily. So Maxwell grabbed his notebook and headed for the door. There you go. So now you guys got the gist of like the story and everything. Uh, I like that they added a story because I've played this game since the very first Scribble Knots, all the way back on the DS before this whole 3DS and, and 3DS XL and DS for your TV, aka Wii U, 
<laughs> so, yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, this game, if you guys don't know already, it's all about creativity and using being creative to solve things. And, but like most open world games, it's fairly linear, uh, the first mission. So this is just sort of showing us the mechanics, so I won't be able to go crazy. But I'm gonna try and let my creative juices flow in this series, I guess. <laughs> Alright, uh, goal! Turn the run to the litter into an award- I thought that said awkward. Into an award-winning pig. Write an object to help Maxwell scrub the pig. Gotcha. Alright. So, here, uh, we could write, like, huge, ginormous scrubbing thing, but that- we're not allowed to use, uh, adjectives here. It's just showing us the mechanics. So, we'll spawn a sponge, and then, bam! And then we will scrub the pig. There we go. Now you're all clean. Uh, click the progress bar for the current hint. I don't need a hint. Yo. Click Max Mel and his... Uh, remove it. Remove. Gotcha. And to the trash can. Boop. The pig looks great. Now use an adjective to increase the pig's size. Alright. Uh, use a... Uh, add adjective. Alright. We'll... We'll, uh... Giant. Bam. There you go. Hold. Wow, that's really big. Help the pig win that the the talent competition. Use an adjective and a noun to create wings large enough to carry the pig. Okay, gotcha. Mm -hmm. I don't need no hints. This is the first mission. For, for, for poop's sake. All right. Uh, large wing. Nah. We'll give him pink wings. Pink wings. There you go. Try making huge wings. Oh, okay. Let's try that again. Huge. Huge wings or large wings? Maybe I should just take out the pink. There we go. Okay, that works. <laughs> the magic backpack stores objects for later. Throw the wings in the backpack and wait for the judges to arrive. Well, that's new. That wasn't in the older games. All right, and then we take this out. Boom, and then bam! Ah, gotcha. Oh, that's neat. So I could just have my preferred items. Blah, it's like blah, your favorite blah, items. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. Aha. Mm hmm. Aha. Let's see. He's facing a tiny baby runt pig and a hamster. I think ours might win. <laughs> just, uh... Just, uh, you know, an assumption. Yay, we won! <laughs> totally didn't cheat or anything like that. Eh, pick up. Yay! We did it. Good job, Maxwell. Good job. I'm proud of you. Alright. See, uh, now that's the only linear mission. It was just teaching us the mechanics. Now we can actually go and have some fun. Earn shards by helping people. Wait, no, there's more. Darn it. <laughs> Uh, by helping people, ten shards will form a starite. Use starite vision to find shards. Gotcha. Okay, starite vision. Boom. Turn off starite vision. Okay. Boom. Uh, help the sprout grow. All right. Mm, let's see. Let's let's make some. Let's let's. Uh, hold on a second. All right. Sorry about that. <laughs> My parents got a 3D TV for Christmas, and they wanted me to try it out, and it looks really interesting so let's make some rain and then we'll put it over the sprouts and it oh god <laughs> it's a man-eating sprout <laughs> no don't hurt the farmer oh the plant scared away the other shard opportunity reset li uh, what can we reset yes reset do we have to redo the pig thing no okay that's good uh, while the notepad can create many things, vulgarity, copyrighted materials, and proper nouns are not allowed. Gotcha. Um, <laughs> unless they're historical, I believe, so we could spawn like Abraham Lincoln if we wanted to. Uh, hello? Do you need any help? Do, do you... My kitty is stuck on top of the tree. Get her for me. Gotcha. Okay. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna give ourselves, um... A purple, because that is the best color. Uh, jet pack. And then, oh, that's like a pink jet pack. Go away. <laughs> well, we'll just give ourselves a, a black jet pack. Oh, hardcore. 
Uh, uh, jets pack. There we go. Excuse my typing if it's slow. And then we can jump up and get the kitty. Pick up. Alright, got your kitty for you. You're welcome. <laughs> Yay! Kitty, come home. I got a star right. Shard. I completed the level, apparently. Yeah, okay, so that was just like the tutorial level. Learning the basics was just the first step towards saving Lily. Use the bus stop to begin your journey in Capital City. Alrighty. You can now play as Maxwell's brother. I don't want to play as Maxwell's brother. Click Maxwell and select fake avatar to play as any unlocked brother. Good. Okay. Uh, tutorial. See, yeah, that was just a tutorial. And that that means we passed it. If there's a star item level. Alright. To the bus stop. And then to Capital City. Yay! Welcome to Capital City. This place is looking pretty bumpin', if you ask me. Downtown, street lights, nighttime. Oh god, d don't fight me. Are you, are you scared? I want someone to entertain me. Okay. Alright, let's uh, type a word and touch the blue button to see similar objects. Blue button? What blue button? The, the, I don't see any blue button. Okay, uh, so let's see. What's entertaining? Uh, stand up comedian. Stand? Standing? Standing comedian. Why not? Oh, hey! That guy looks like a stand up comedian. What? Oh. Wow. You're magical! Are you David Blaine? I mean, you kind of look like him. I'm a big fan of yours. Can you levitate for me? I like your suit. It's pretty classy. It's very classy, in fact. Let's go over here. There's nothing over here. Okay. Um, so, the, this here, this hospital, these buildings are like mini levels inside of levels. It's like level section. So I'll do that last. Uh, let's see. What's up with you? Oops. I'm parked illegally. All right. Um, what we're gonna do then is we're gonna give ourselves a bazooka, and then we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna kill that car. Attack! You're welcome. Oh no! Ant! The ant killed me. <laughs> oh god! Ant, why? Why would you do such a terrible thing? Darn it, Ant. Darn it. You betrayed me. And you just... Ah, oh, man. Who would have thought Ant? Out of all people. Alright, we'll, we'll give him the clown this time. Hold on. Scary clown. Oh god! <laughs> That's horrifying! Be entertained. Hey! It worked! <laughs> He's dancing! And the scary clown is gonna murder someone. What? Okay, away I go. Alright, ants, don't you do anything this time. Alright, let's give ourselves a giant powerful fan. Uh, tool. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, can we flip that? Ah! I wanna flip it. How do I flip? How do I flip? How do I flip this? Can I... Pr ah! E is flip. I'm a genius. There you go. Get out of here. Yay. Oh, God. <laughs> the policeman is attacking the scary clown. Is the scary clown attacking anyone, or is he just trying to scare people? I think he's just trying to scare people. Well, you know what, scary clown? Go away. How you doing, off a car? You good? Let's see. Extremely tall. Oh, I spelled extremely wrong. Um, elderly. Well, that worked. Let's see, what's up with this? Uh, so unsightly! Yeah. See, what's- I don't- I don't understand graffiti. Because it's- it's a bunch of letters, right? And letters make words, right? Why would you write the letters so that no one understands what it says? That just- you're not representing if you're not even saying anything. You know what I mean? <laughs> ah, white people. That's me. Let's see. Let's get ourselves a... Uh, uh, I don't know. A hose. No, fire hose. Give ourselves a fire hose. Uh, use this to attach. Okay, I will attach this to myself. 
attach and then wait no 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 I lied do not attach I will spawn a fire hydrant I think this is how you do it hydrant yeah there we go and then I will attach the fire hose to the fire hydrant and give this to me and then give that to me attach there I attach that there we go and then use that do that do whatever you're supposed to do Dude, I don't think it's working. God dang it. Uh, water, water. <laughs> Darn it. Whatever. You're useless. You're useless to me. Uh, we'll just do it the boring way. Die! Ah! Uh, uh, die! Uh. I can't believe that works. That's amazing. See, kids, violence solves everything. <laughs> let's let us let's, let's take this away. Uh, we'll, we'll just drag that to the trash can. Keep the city clean, you know. I mean, I'm I'm spending time cleaning it up, making it nice for everyone. I don't want to mess it up myself. Let's see. What what's your deal? What's your major malfunction? Lay someone into the phone booth to make a sidekick for me. Okay. Um. Grandma. Yep, there you go. You're welcome. Oh, hey, Grandma, you got younger. Yay, it's a bird. <laughs> Sweet. All right, uh, let's see. You can now play as Maxwell something. Switch for the fountain, place an object in the water, then flip the switch. All right. What should we put in the thing? I know. We should put a beanie. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Let's put a giant beanie. Giant... Black beanie. There we go. That's more like it. And then we flip the switch. Boom! Yay! <laughs> That's awesome. You know, I should have put a cat head in there as well. Or some sort of cat. <laughs> That's beautiful. That's just. That's lovely. Alright, you guys play by that fountain. The water seems to be going everywhere. Is that a hazard? Are people gonna slip and fall and sue? Is there suing in this game? Oh god, let's not think about that. What's up with you? Uh, oh, it's a, a thingy. A quest or a mission. Mission, that's what I was thinking of. Uh, Carnival Games. Let's start. Carnival Games, start. Yes. This this sounds fun. I'm, I'm looking forward to this. The carnival is in town. Throw something to knock over the bottles, but don't cross the barrier. Alright, uh, what should we throw? Molotov... Cocktail. I spelled Molotov. Molotov cocktail. There we go. Alright. Uh, let's see. Oh, lag. Whoa, slow motion. I'm moonwalking. Moon oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yay, I did it! <laughs> Is that legal? I don't think so. Throw something to pop the balloons without crossing the barrier. Okay, let's see. What should we get? Um, mid... Medieval. Nah, let's just spike ball. Can I? Ah, uh, spiked ball. That doesn't look very spiky, but. Ow! Oh god! Oh god! Oh pain! Ah, get away from me! Ow! Oh no! <laughs> that thing is a danger and a menace to everyone! Throw something to hit the dunk tank without crossing the barrier. Ah, get out of here! No, don't run towards it! You're gonna die! No! 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 Ah! Uh, uh, there you go. Oh, jeez. I saved your life, bro. You should be thanking me. And why am I dressed up as a clown? That's really scary. Alright, um, dunk tank. Dunk tank. Dunk tank. Uh, RPG. You're welcome. Um. Yes! Oh no! It worked! I killed her, but it worked! Oh no! Oh, that sucks. Couldn't I just picked up the star right? Ah, darn it. Nope. Whatever. It's alright. We can just do it again with different things. But yeah, this is a test of my, my creative juices, as I like to call them. Um, <laughs> let's see. There, There's not a lot of them. They're like en empty tanks. Like, there's an arrowhead water bottle right here. It's like, it's empty. That's what the creative juices are. Okay, um, let's see. What should we throw at it? 
Let's let's just throw a um, we'll throw a, a dog at it. All right. All right. Uh, throw. Can I throw it? I cannot throw the dog. Okay, so dog is not throwable. Okay, see you later, dog. Let us try throwing, I don't know, a grenade. That This is surefire to just definitely blow away the competition. Oh, well that was anticlimactic. Whatever. All right, let's do this legitimate. We'll do it the legitimate way. We'll just get a dart. And we will pop the balloon with a dart, as intended by the makers of the game. Boom! Yay! I did it. That's so boring. I like using stupid things. Let's use stupid things. Um, ostrich. That's definitely not how you spell ostrich. Egg. Uh huh. Ostrich. Obese egg. Yep. That's a. That's a very fat egg. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Yay! I just drowned a person. Welcome. Yeah! I did it! I feel so accomplished. My sister will be saved in no time. Oh yeah, speaking of the sister, uh, the girl who voiced the female shepherd from Mass Effect 3, I believe, voiced her. So there's something. Uh, what are you? Who are you? I want to sail across the sea. Alright. It's all right, I'll, I'll just give you this giant diamond yacht. No, that's Y-H-A-T. Yak, yacht, yakajita. Da, definitely. You'll be rolling in style, bro. Only the best for my main man. <laughs> See you later, bro. Have a nice life. All right, now uh, we will go into what's that? Oh, we'll do that next episode. We'll go into the hospital, and then we'll go across and we'll do all the mini mission things. Uh, we'll do that in the next episode. <laughs> Welcome to Saint Asterisk. Yeah, that was terrible pronunciation. All right, uh, let's do this. There we go. Oh wait, oh we could scroll in. I kind of like it close like this. Okay, uh, what's wrong with you? Give me something that I can use to perform surgery. What, anything wrong with you? No, okay. Kenpo, uh, oh, I'm related to him. I will save you, brother. Okay, uh, let's see, let's, what, what is, what is, we need some pain meds. Pain medication. Uh, uh, medicine, pain medicine. Plain medicine. Good enough. Okay. Ah, that worked. Whatever. That's not what I intended. I was gonna have her do work on him with a chainsaw, but, you know, I guess that's a lot more reasonable. Uh, help the patients that are coming into the hospital. Gotcha. I love this game so much. This is an awesome game. <laughs> uh, I've also been playing a lot of Far Cry 3, and the reason why I'm not recording it is that my computer wouldn't be able to handle it. Uh, it can handle a lot of games, like as you can see, it can handle Borderlands and stuff like that. But Far Cry 3, just it's got so many foliage and so many beautiful light effects and everything. I wouldn't be able to record it. Uh, yeah, that, that game's amazing. I've only had it for two days and I've already played it for like 15 hours or something like that. Uh, Gold! Help the patients that are being delivered to St. Asterisk Hospital. Alright. I'll help you guys. Oh, it's a cat! Um, sick kitten. All right, I'll, I'll, t I'll take care of you. Sick as a dog. Ah, I, I see what you did there. All right, what do we what do we need? What what do cats? Uh, antibiotic. All right, here you go, kitty. Yay, it worked. Ah, uh, he just he just had some bacteria in him. He's fine. All right, what's next? Teeth. Um, I'll take it. Ouch, must be a toothache. Okay. Let's remove this. Oh, no, no, no. I want that. Whatever. Remove that. Oh, no, 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 no. No! I think my antibiotic already got removed. Oh, and I can't pick these up. Oh, yes, I can. No, I can't. Whatever. Alright, uh, we need some... Uh, a drill. Alright. Ah, sorry, teeth. 
I, I know that hurt, but you know, you're good now. You're all fine. Remove. Uh. Uh. Oh, it's a robot. Hey, what are you doing? Why don't you help them, doctor? All right, well, let's see. What's what's wrong with you? Um, let's uh, remove. Oh, that's. Yup. Okay, that probably didn't help you at all. Uh, let's see. What do you need? What do, what do robots need? We need a. We need a tech. Nissan. That's what we need. Help him. Good job. That's. I don't know what you did, but you did your thing and uh, it worked. Am I am I training or something? Is that why you're just watching me? Is this like speed medication? The book story isn't complete. Where's the last chapter? It's. Oh, um, I don't know. Last chapter. Oh, okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> I, I I was gonna be extremely cheap there. Okay, let's just we'll get ourselves a pen and we'll write it ourselves. Boom. Welcome. I win. Can I be a doctor now? No? More. What else is a car? Oh man, alright, we need a blowtorch. That's what we need to fix cars, right? I'm a technician, don't worry. I know how to fix everything. Okay, boom. Oops. Bam. Bam. Okay, that didn't work. We need... Um... I don't know, what do, what do you use to fix cars? I would tell you to leave it in the comments section, but I, I, I'm not on this end, and I, I won't be able to see into the future. Um, <laughs> so I need to find out now, darn it. I'm an American, and I, I need things to happen right now. Uh, I should know a lot more about cars than I do, considering the fact that I'm almost, or no, that I am? No, old, almost old enough to get my permit. Uh, what do you need to fix cars? You need jumpers, jumper cables, jumper cable. You need that, okay. And then we'll spawn another uh, a working car. Spawn another. Car. Wait, can I just add an adjective and put working? Whatever, that's not creative. Okay, and then what? What? Oh yay, it works! I can't believe it. Genius. Yes. I feel smart. I feel accomplished. That's such a good feeling. Yeah, I'll pick this up with pride. Yay! Doctor's on call complete. Total star at three. We're off to a good scart. Scart? Scart. Well, there goes our good start. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Lily and we'll give her the stuff. And uh, Hopefully your leg will be better. Let's, I, I got an achievement. Are you all good? Did, hey, she's happy. Oh, she gave me a globe. Oh, it's the magical globe from the intro. Boom! I just, I just died. I exploded. Oh no, what happened? We gave her a star. She should be all better. Oh, that sucks. Oh, we unlocked new areas though. Oh, there's still so many more things for us to do. Um... Well, I'm gonna end it here. It seems like a good place to end it, and I feel like I've been recording for a while. Um, thank you once again uh, for giving me this game. It means a lot. And thank you everyone who watches my videos and comments them and likes them. That You're helping me a lot. Um, I don't physically get anything from it, I guess. But I just, I don't know. I, I do this for you guys. This is That's the only reason why I do this. So hopefully I can make your guys' day better or maybe brighten it up. I don't know. I try. I try my best. <laughs> but uh, if you like the video, leave a like down below and tell me if I should do all of this. Like, all of it. Or if I should just go by world to do a quick series. I don't know. Leave a comment. And, uh, yeah. I will see you all next time.